saying. You're what's wrong with America. Close to true light, you do as little as possible, and you leech on decent, hardworking people like me. <laughs> if you lived in any of the countries in the world, you'd starve to death long ago. He's got you there, Dad. You're a fraud. A, a total fraud. Nice meeting you. Quiet. 
trying to make him go crazy. They don't have no modern technology and back in the 1800s and 1600s. But, you know, it's all good. He, he I, I, from my personal point of view, I believe he deserves to die. Because I bet you that his blood is darker than black. Mm. So, do you have any concerns what's going to happen next to France? I said I do not because we got a riot going on in the background. As you can see, there was oranges and stuff being thrown all over the place, all over in the area. Back to you. So, if you didn't notice, what he was holding up was not a gun. He was kind of slow. But it was a national reason. Now, they have a small, medium, and large. What they usually use on victims. What the heck is a small, medium, and large? I'm not at McDonald's buying myself a meal. What are you talking about? You make me laugh, Kyle. What I mean is that big, medium, small. You mean like that small? Yeah. Pretty much you. But anyway, back to Irving. So, we have a tennis player here who also saw his, the king's death. So, what do you think, what do you think about the king's death? Actually, I don't have any comment on that. It was just very sad. He deserves to die, but unlike him, I have my athletic ability all over here. Now, I really love, love the bowl, but tennis is my prize jewel. We got a major riot again. In the background, it was, it was crazy, but now, back to you. Okay. Wait, wait, do you, do you believe that King Leonard 16 should have died, or should he just stay alive? He shouldn't die, because he's, he's, a, he's a nice kid. He was just raised wrong by the, by the giants of France. It's crazy. You know, that's all uh, I need to say. Back to you, sir. Wow, that was a lot of, that was crazy. But while we're waiting for the rest of the news on TMZ, here is some earlier news that he did before he died. As Louis Mind the scoundrel, he appeared dignified and resigned. He delivered a short speech in which he recited his innocence and pardoned those responsible for his death. Now, let's go to an eyewitness and see what he thinks about that. Okay. <laughs> Uh, 